<laughs> I uh, did a little damage. Uh, still, all of this stuff was just a little over $100. Um, it wasn't too bad. I did get some stuff on sale, and um, that, and, and the only, I asked for fragrance samples. Let's see what I got here. I haven't even opened this yet. Because I, when I, when I opt for a variety or skin care stuff, I always get the same exact stuff. So this is La Dice Pure. Hmm. I do not know. And then um, Aqua de Geo, Geo. And is this a men's? Yeah, it is. Okay. Which, that does me a lot of good. Thanks, guys. All right. So let's get on with this. Um, I do have swatches. I swatched yesterday. I swatched all day. <laughs> but I'm going to show you the other stuff I got first, I guess. Um, I have not even tried this yet. This is, I, I got a color jolt. Jolt. Uh, Maybelline color jolt. I wanted to try one of these out, see if they're as good as the um, Melteds by like these. There's a little difference. These here are a little fatter though, I think. So let me look once and see if they have the my eyes today, I'll tell you what. Five mil. Oh, this is 6.4 mil. So this, you actually get more in this than you do the melted. Well, but this is, what, $25, 20, $21 to $25, and this is 7 <laughs> I didn't buy it for 7 I got it on sale. But um, anyway, the color I got was Strip Down, number 5. And let's just look. Oh, that's pretty. That is pretty. I'm excited to wear that. And then I also got a Makeup Revolution Vivid Baked Highlighter in Peach Lights is what I got. The other ones, that one looked really white. And one looked way too dark. So, and I got my nails done yesterday. So everything's a little harder to do the, today. Opening stuff is not fun today. I wonder if this is taped. Of course. So I'm without my car right now. It's at the body shop. Getting, I probably won't have it till tomorrow. Getting, uh shocks replaced been bouncing around like this <laughs> and the car's driving around like a low rider you know I, you, people must expect the back to go like this <laughs> if anybody knows what I'm talking about okay there it is isn't that pretty packaging that is so pretty let's just Oh my, that's pretty. I hope you can see that because it's really pretty. Yep, happy with that. Okay, let's just stick with the Make Naked Revolution. And I got a The Stripped and Bare palette. It's a pretty um, copper. And I'm having trouble getting stuff open, so I've been using my trusty letter opener. Just slide it under there. There's a tip for you if you can't get stuff open. And it opens right up for you. 
And this is what it looks like. It's probably dirty because I swatched and swatched and swatched yesterday. And it comes with a double end, not a brush, sponge applicator. Which, uh, and this is what it looks like. Which, you know, a lot of these are way too dark for me. But I swatched one, two, three is how I swatched these. And here are the swatches. So some of these were very light. The top ones barely showed up. Some of these first ones, whoop, first ones here, um, were very light. But, you know, I'll mix and match. I'll use, you know, I, I will use, I'm going to try to use every single palette or every single uh, look is what they call them. So this is like look three, this is look two, and this is look one. Each has five deals. So um, I will try to use every single one, and I will be using that in an upcoming Makeup of the Week. Because I know I can get six looks out of here. <laughs> All right, there is the Makeup Revolution Stripped and Bare Palette. Palette one. Okay, then um, I wanted to try a, an Essence palette. You know, I, I've got something from Essence. What do I have? I don't know, but I saw this and I thought, I have got to have this. I have got to. This is the All About Bronze palette. Oh my lord. I love these colors. Look at that. Aren't they gorgeous? Well, you could tell where I was. They're so soft and so buttery and so pigmented they're oh my gosh they're beautiful i'll have to use a matte palette with these you know for a complete eye look but i will use every single one of these colors and here are the swatches aren't they gorgeous oh my i love this palette um, I am very happy. The Makeup Revolution, I forgot to tell you. You know, some of them, um, the darker colors, of course, are easier to, are more pigmented. The lighter colors are way less pigmented. You have to work to get a look out of those. And they're powdery. But I still love Makeup Revolution. I, I just, I think they're gorgeous shadows. But I am, so far, let's see how this, this, keeps on the eye, but I am so far absolutely loving this Essence palette <clears throat> for All About Bronze. They have other ones, like they have like an All About Nudes or All About Maybe Gold or something, which I'm thinking about. But these are very, um, not, you know, drugstore priced palettes. Okay, then I broke down and I got the BH Cosmetics Carly Bible Palette. My goodness, isn't that pretty? You know, the thing that disappoints me about this palette, though, is there's no names on any of the colors. And, like, there's no picture on the back, you know, that even shows you the palette or anything. Um, it's magnetic, which is nice. I love those. It's got a nice mirror. It says, Aspire to Inspire, which is wonderful. And it's got the deal here that is a ta it's taped on, so I'll just keep it on there probably. But here is the palette. You know, and it's all warm nudes. Absolutely beautiful. And those highlights, holy cow. I mean, these two highlights... I'll use as eyeshadows. Now, you know, I will not be using them as highlights. But these two here are absolutely gorgeous. So, here come the swatches.
Eh? Pretty nice, huh? They're gorgeous. And they're they're pretty pigmented. Um, some of them are really, really soft. So, uh, like this one here is really soft. Just soft and buttery. You know, you just, you have to remember going from drugstore to higher end. The, you know, Beach Cosmetic is, is kind of in the middle, you know, price-wise. But um, you have to kind of remember you have to put your brush in, you know, the drugstore, you know, a few times. Higher end, one time will do you. And I forget that. <laughs> so some of these, I don't know. They're just so pretty. So, so pretty. I absolutely am in love with this palette. I don't know why I didn't get it sooner. Because it's so affordable. It was like $14.99 or something like that. Drugstore prices are right, right above drugstore, actually. Okay, and the last thing I got was the Anastasia Beverly Hills. I have heard such awesome things about this palette. Um, it's absolutely... Oh, I, I know it's going to be my, one of my favorites. But it's kind of velvety feeling. I'm afraid it's going to get really dirty, though, because of the light color. And everything stick to it. And then there's the back. Okay, so let's open it up, and it's got Anastasia Beverly Hills on the mirror, you know, on the, the sticky thing on the mirror. I haven't taken it off yet, and it's got the logo there. It's got a double-ended brush. I have not tried this yet. It's got a nice eye brush and then a nice blending brush. Okay, I'm just going to put that down or else it's going to fall down, but look at that. Yum! I can't wait. I cannot wait to use this. So, here are the swatches. Okay, what did you guys think? I tell you what, I put my brush in this one here. It's the first shimmer one. Oh my God, the brush about sunk right into it. I thought, oh, I'm going to use up half of the dang stuff, you know, every time I use it. I just have to be careful because they are so buttery and so soft. So you just have to, I don't know. Um, I haven't watched, intentionally watched too awful many uh, reviews on this, but the a couple that I did watch, they absolutely said this was their favorite all-time palette. But it's so beautiful. And, you know... It's going to be easy to do eye looks. I mean, some of those, the reds are, some of those are a little bit too dark for, like, an everyday work stuff. But, and they've got, these two colors here are just going to be so pretty for transitions. These two. And then the, then you've got this one you can use which is transition. Oh, there's a lot of different things that you can do with this palette, believe me. And I will be doing this in an upcoming Making It Work, for sure. Alright, guys, that is my Ulta haul. Thank you so much for, for staying with me. If um, if you want to look at those those swatches, just make sure that you pause your video and, and you could take a screenshot or you could, you know, or just pause it and look at them. But they're absolutely beautiful. I had fun doing this. I was tired by the time I was done and tired by the time I I got done doing my um, photo or photoshopping or whatever. So anyway, I will see you in my next video. Bye bye.